Good evening. They, uh, I'm Tina. So long time no see. Okay. Um, this video it's gonna be pretty short because uh, it's a bug fix. Okay. Let me show you the behavior. I think several. I saw the comments and uh, and also from my friend. There's a problem when we when I delete the items from the shopping cart, the price is not being taken care of. So this video is to fix that. Where's my cursor? Okay. Um, so the problem is uh, if I add a add item into a shopping cart, shopping cart. And let's uh, oh, sorry. Let's add uh, several more. Add to shopping cart. And uh, add to shopping cart. Let me add more. Okay. Let me add this one. One more. This one. One more. Okay. And now in the shopping cart, the price is changed, right? This one is good. But when I delete the item, like Angular, the price should be a uh, four plus three. Should be seven, but when I delete this one, the price remains no change, and the same thing for this one remains no change. The problem is because in our code here, I didn't take care of the total price, it should be easy to fix. So, what we do is here we can get the pro product. Okay, uh, sorry. Uh, um, cart has the products and have total price. Okay. So here, const product equal, or we can see uh, existing pro deleted, deleted product equals, we can use in cart dot products. Mm, we can use the index to find the product, right? Yeah. How can I copy paste? I'm still new to Mac. You cannot. Dot find. I think we have. Do we have a find method? Products. Dot find. Okay. Hope you can find. Otherwise, we were using. Uh, this one, okay, and once we find the product, we can also like a card dot total price minus equals deleted the product dot price. I think there's a price on this one, uh, and the price multiply the it has product product should have. Uh, uh, price right and they also have a quantity okay multiply the c q t y i kind of using q t y here, so here multiply the latest product that q t y okay like this okay this one uh find should be working if not working we can use in the bracket okay like this then we save Command S is a seven, right? Still not familiar with Mac. Okay, so I think it's done. So now let's take a look at if I update the product now, uh, delete the product now if the price is being changed. So we go back, and uh, should be nothing because we start restarted the application. We have to add the product. Let's use the Angular price is one image url is angular one good okay and add another one uh, note price is two and the image url and good okay let's still do two okay now i add to shopping cart go back and uh, add to shopping cart okay then go back Add to shopping cart. Okay, now the, the price correct. Now I do delete this one. Now the price is changed to be two. And this one, it won't be 
nothing okay and now if i add to shopping cart then i delete this node okay delete it change to b1 okay so i it's not difficult right if i add one more and add one more and add one more and if i delete this one the total price should be two because we have when we remove here we remove all the quantities okay remove all the nodes so delete become two so now it's fixed so that's it for this uh, bug and uh, uh, see you hopefully we'll see you tomorrow okay bye bye